Okay, we'll have a toast for Mr. and Mrs. Larson again, mm -hmm. Lucilla's anniversary, you repeat it again. We're all very happy to be here and celebrate with you, and we're very proud of you, and wish you another 25 years. Yeah. Congratulations. Mr. Thank and Mrs. you everybody Larson. for coming. I really appreciate you all being here and making it so special for us. Thank you. Cheers. 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 Mm. I wrote a little something. Okay. Oh, sorry. Um, Michelle and Ted, 25 years of marriage. I think I speak for everyone here when I say, wow, well, congratulations. I am so proud and happy to share this wonderful day. I love you both. It is so wonderful to look around and recall all the memories I have. Thanks to both of you, and I wanted to say thank you both. <laughs> because of the two of you, I have a lot of them. Firstly, thank you for my godson. Watching him grow up were truly some of the best years of my life, and seeing him now as a grown man, happy and healthy, it makes me so proud. And it's thanks to his parents' love, understanding, and caring. When I look back, I remember all the holidays you both made special. Shaking. <laughs> Uh, it's made special bringing our families together and bringing all the family together is no easy task in my book two of the years you have shown me love by not only loving me by loving each other ted i know there were hard times i mean come on she's a petner and michelle he's a larson <laughs> but you weathered the storms no matter what and sometimes i truly believe the only thing you both thought you may have had was love to get you through it but i know there was more michelle and ted you are both passionate and caring individuals and i've always believed soulmates you had a true love. God has been with you throughout your marriage. Michelle, my sister, and Ted, my brother, I, I hope you both know that if either of you ever need me, I will be here to the good times and be here forever. Again, thank you for the memories. Thank you for loving each other and for sometimes being the glue that keeps this family together. I love you so very much. appreciate and respect you both. Congratulations. Now I'd like to remember all those who you love so much who are no longer with us. Pumpkin, Pumpkin, Tiny, <laughs> Mr. Larson, Lenny, Joe, Grandma Petner, and Uncle John. These are just a few of my favorites. I know, really know in my heart, they are here with us today at this table, so proud. Can you feel it? They're gone, but never forgotten. I think I speak on behalf of all of us here when I say we love you and thanks for the memories. And in the words of Jerry Garcia, keep on trucking. God mm -hmm. bless. Now I would like to take you down memory lane. We met at Eleanor's New Year's Eve party way back when, and Michelle at the time was a teenager, but wise beyond her years, because she wanted no parts of Ted Sr. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> Ted, you walked in with your wrong Robert Plant hair and Jane Bean's personality. We sat on the couch. I can see your face now like it was yesterday. Remember you told me I'm going to marry your sister. <laughs> All bright-eyed, so full of tomorrow, foreseeing your future. I, I, of course, laughed and said, get out of here. She can't stand you. <laughs> <laughs> well, you never gave up. Michelle decided <coughs> to date you, finally, and we giggled. We were kids. We were all living at home at the time. You then dated. Mich Michelle, remember you were kissing senior, and Mom came along on the corner? You said, this is my boyfriend. Mom said, I don't give a fuck who he is. Get in this house. <laughs> I did. Yeah, what a bitch. Uh, well, as we grew up, we all realized bitch meant a wonderful, loving, and yes, crazy mother. Then, not long after, out of this true love came a miracle, the Savior. Along came Ted Jr. <laughs> well, how exciting for all of us. I believe he changed everyone's lives. He brought total joy to our whole family. You were married at Dugans and moved into Jackson Street apartment. What good times. You didn't have a lot of money, but it never showed. Nobody cared or even realized it for that matter because there was love, true love in that house. Oh, and thanks for adopting me during those years. Again, true <laughs> memories of a lifetime. <laughs> you then moved to Plum Street with Mom, then to Castor Avenue. In that time, you have weathered the losses of loved ones, jobs, enjoyed camping, holidays, eating at every restaurant in Philadelphia, <laughs> surgeries, arguments, Good times and bad times, and here we are today. Thank you, Jesus, celebrating. 
after 25 years, wow, 25 years, you are still. <laughs> Sorry. Um, if you are still together and still in love. True first date, will she date me, love? Well, I'm happy to say I'm really not surprised. Finally, in my own words, I'd like to say, keep on loving each other, never take each other for granted, and I look forward to the next 25 years. Thank you for being such a huge part of my, my and my family's life. I love you both very much, and again, on behalf of all of us here, thanks for the memories, and we love you so much. Love, it really is all you need. Dreaming of <coughs> dreams come true. Keep on trucking, and finally, you may be right, I may be crazy, but it just may be a lunatic you're looking for. Happy anniversary. Thank you so much. Thank you. I just want to give you these things because they kind of go with everything. Here's your glass. Happy anniversary.